Good afternoon, my friends. Uh, today I'm in El Medenia, not very far from Martyrs Memorial, and uh, I'm on this lovely street here. Now I'm going to show you how I usually do in order to avoid traffic uh, in the central or at the central square of El Medenia, you know, the roundabout, the main roundabout where the bus station is, not the roundabout where the 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 town hall or the city hall is located so I'll show you how I do just look at how beautiful and bright Algiers looks when uh, I mean on on a beautiful spring day where in March mid March 2023 this is uh, Martyrs Memorial built to honor uh, the million and a half Algerians who died for the independence of Algeria. Built in 1982 to mark the 20th anniversary of the independence of the nation. And this year, the nation is celebrating its 60th uh, independence anniversary. The Esplanade is above. And uh, there is a mall here on the right. And the garage, if you want to visit this place by car, the garage is on the right. The area also has a has a museum and now I'll show you first I'll show you how I enter Salombier or uh, El Madania then I'll show you now if you want to go to Cuba you take the left the ramp on the left but we are taking the right road here instead the cemetery of El Madania is uh, on the right on the top of this uh, hill here on the right. Now if you want to go to Le Fusillier and the city center you take the left at the roundabout. If you want to go to Les Amasiens you can take that ramp over there from where those cars are coming down. It's a very hilly street. One of the hilliest here in Algiers. So hilly that I hate taking it unless it's necessary. And there is this beautiful park here on the left. The only my own park already told you about it in so many videos and now I'm going to merge into the right lane here in order to enter uh, Mbadenia. This is my favorite entrance. It's uh, the entrance to uh, the Medani Brothers Street. The address is on the left of course. Okay so sometimes when I try to leave this neighborhood when I try to drive from this neighborhood to the city center via the, the main roundabouts of this neighborhood, via the central part of this neighborhood, I, found, I find a lot of traffic and it's pretty annoying, pretty annoying. So I will show you the place where I usually find traffic, a very busy place, it's, it's the busiest place here in this neighborhood and then I'll show you how to avoid that traffic. very quickly or as quickly as I can these days it's, it's beginning to, to get to get hot these days and I think that you know if it continues like this with global warming uh, soon we will no longer have spring we will lose two seasons in fact I guess that here in Algeria we have already lost one we no longer have fall or autumn we no longer have it uh, our autumns are uh, as, just as hot as uh, our uh, our summers you know and now I think that uh, we, are, we are more and more losing spring so this is the first square here or the first roundabout here in uh, in uh, Medellin this is the roundabout of the city hall as you can see the city hall here on the right and it's surrounded by uh, all these stores here There is a post office over there, so this is a very busy area. And there is a restaurant here, and there are there is a, an ice cream parlor over there. There is a, a, a cafe, and uh, there is a, also a mini mart, hardware store, and many grocery stores here. So there are lots of people who come to eat here, eat and drink. Uh, all right, and this is the second 
roundabout. And the problem with these roundabouts here, with this area, very area in particular, is that they, you know, it gets busy, especially here, and especially when you see a bus like this on the right uh, around, you know. So the bus is here. Uh, okay. The bus is here. Uh, collecting people, collecting passengers, and, uh, you know, the, there are lots of cars. Normally, all these cars parked, uh, 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 all these cars you see here shouldn't be parked here because, as far as I, I know, it's uh, it's illegal to park uh, at a roundabout. And then this is the hilliest place. Uh, I mean, the, the 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 most infernal place in in this area, especially during rush hour. But not just during rush hour. So now I'll show you how I do in order to avoid this place altogether. Well, I guess that I'm going to have to make a big detour now in order to return to the same area and then show you how I avoid it. And this will depend on, you know, my knowledge of how to navigate my way around this neighborhood. As you can see, Salombi is just, is not just those main streets I usually uh, you show you. Uh, in my videos, it's much more than that. It has many, many, many alleys, just like these ones here. They are nice residential alleys, and I'm going to try and show you how to avoid that area altogether. Okay, so now we are going to enter this apartment complex, one of the oldest here in the area. I'm going to drive, or try to drive as far as the cemetery in order to, to return to the, to the first roundabout I showed you. Just look at that corner over there, you see, where that lady is walking. It seems like, a, you know, a dead end, but in fact it's a road. leads somewhere I guess that uh, this is the first time I'm filming I'm ever filming this area Despite the fact, I'm rather surprised that this is the first time I'm filming this area. Despite the fact that I filmed or I featured this neighborhood uh, countless times before. These buildings uh, are colonial. They were, uh, I mean, they date back. They are, uh, they were built within a, a colonial program uh, of affordable housing, you know. And they are still uh, maintained to this day but I think that uh, the people living here should be relocated because I, I don't really think that this these houses are good and I think that uh, our local authorities are now uh, taking this problem in charge okay right way. I usually park my car here when I visit uh, uh, the Martyrs Memorial and uh, there is an entrance to the Martyrs Memorial here, here on the on the left. The door is open for the public. This is a middle school, Abbas Lagro Middle School. And there is a kindergarten here on, on the right. And there's also this mosque. The cemetery is on the left, by the way, the, the entrance to the cemetery, to the El Madania cemetery is here on, on the left. And of course, this neighborhood is much cleaner and better than, than before, than, than 20 years ago. Okay, I'm not going this way. You should let me pass.
great. Uh, now we are back. This is the post office I showed you earlier, and we are back. Uh, back at, at, the, at the roundabout okay you have the right of way so the right of way is for cars coming from the left that restaurant on the manor is one of uh, my favorite if my, my favorites yes there are people crossing uh, a zebra crossing here so we've got to let them pass let them cross all right so now yeah that's the second roundabout and before i reach that roundabout i'll take this alley here on the right Although sometimes even this alley is crowded, but it's only crowded with with, uh, with pedestrians. There is this uh, new fast food uh, or uh, fast food uh, shop here on the right, uh, serving liver liver sandwiches. So uh, and and it has lots of uh, lots of customers. You know, lots of people coming here to enjoy a liver sandwich probably with the fries you know and uh, this is the the alley I take okay do you like this yes and all this is in order to leave this area okay so I'm showing you this shortcut or this detour in order to show you how to leave this area in case you find uh, traffic uh, at the roundabout at the at the second roundabout and now I take the left you, w w when driving on streets like these you've got to negotiate your way with other drivers uh, so there is traffic coming from the other I mean from the opposite direction and you've got to know how to you know I mean, you've got to organize yourselves and uh, take turns in passing. There used to be a building here on the right. I worked there for a while uh, back in 2003, 2002. It was in late 2002 and early 2003. It was a uh, video club. And now the building, yes, the building was demolished. So perhaps uh, a couple of years ago, there is nothing left of it to run that with that store there we sold the uh, CDs and tapes and we rented uh, video tapes and now yeah here we are back to the area where the the martyrs memorial can be seen and I have managed to leave the area in just a couple minutes you know I mean gr driving from the from the first roundabout so that's how I usually do now in order to leave uh, El Madania uh, if you want to get familiar with all these alleys you shouldn't be afraid of, of exploring them and now there is a stop sign here let's just go so uh, that was me trying to show you how to uh, leave uh, okay how to navigate your way inside El Madania and also how to uh, avoid driving as far as uh, the second roundabout where the bus stop uh, where the bus station is in order to uh, in order to exit this this neighborhood and now from here you can go anywhere you want uh, both to the eastern parts of the city or the western parts of the city uh, i hope that you found this video interesting if you did please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe uh, and click the notifications button in order to receive notifications on my future videos Drive safely, visit Algeria, visit Algeria, take care of yourselves and goodbye.